make this type of video just so I can make it longer and so you can keep it in your gallery. Point is, the three main things to gain, the three main things, how I got the connections and network and how I got in these studios is my manager, is my manager, St. Paul. He put me, he's a dot connector. He connects the dots on one dot, hop was another dot. He connects that dot and makes the play, right? My manager, my networking, bro. I used to network every fucking day, bro. I network more than I make beats, bro. That's the key, bro. You got to keep tapping with people. Hey, can I send beats? Can I send beats? Hey, let me follow up. But you got to look professional, bro. Like I'm seeing your Instagram right now. I need you to look more of a producer. And what that means is like, I need pics of you in the studio. I need cover art. No, I need not cover art. Pics of you in the studio. Any songs you worked on, post it, bro. And then like literally your profile pic got to be you in the studio. Something like that, bro. So I know you're a producer, bro. That's just what a producer looks like. That's your brand. Same reason when you go into Target, there's Target, red, white, everywhere. Or you walk into Walmart, blue, the logo, everything. Because that's the brand. The brand is everything. And once you get the brand right, then you could tap in with people. Because trust me, once Paul, St. Paul, worked on my brand and told me, you just do that, do that. And I did it. I started tapping with people. People put respect on my name, bro. Oh, shit, you're true bands. You worked on Hot Boy. How do I know? Because I saw your bio and I saw your Instagram page. Simple as that, bro. Isn't this a just work on your brand, work on your network? And I'll be honest with you, bro. The only reason I got this far, bro, and if you're not religious, bro, then it doesn't apply to you, bro. But if you have some sort of, like, connection with religion, bro, I'm going to tell you right now, it was by the grace of God, bro. Simple as that, bro. Everything I asked God for has happened, bro, and it's crazy, bro. It sounds it sounds crazy, bro, but I'm telling you, bro, I'm living. I'm a living example of why I have done what I've done through the grace of God, bro. Um, Basically, if you want anything with God, bro, just ask God. Simple as that and write it down. Simple as that and... I'm going to, like, do this for me, bro. Like, if you're going to take anything, bro, just do this for me. Write down 50 things you want and say, I have. I have a Lambo. I have a song with a million plays. I have a Planet Plague. I have Met Hot Boy. Something like that, whatever. And I'm telling you, bro, write 50 things. And in a year, bro, you're going to knock out some of those things, bro. I don't know how many, bro, but you're going to at least knock out one. I promise you that, bro. So write down 50 things, bro, that you want, but say, I have. Manifest that shit, bro. I literally manifested it, bro. I'm telling you, bro, it got to the point where I, it sounds crazy, bro. It really does, but like I was at a point when I like first heard about all this law of attraction and asking God and God in my life. I was at a point where I was willing to do anything to like make it right, and I did that, bro. And it has worked. And the reason why I am in my position that I am today, and I got a song with Hopway that dropped last night, it's because through the grace of God. Simple as that, bro. Uh, the reason I met Paul, the grace of God, hundred percent, bro. Literally, I wrote the beginning of twenty twenty. I wanna, I wanna be in sessions in Florida. I wanna meet Hopway. I want a song with a million plays. I wanna. All this stuff, right? I want a major placement, all this stuff. I want to advance. I want a royalty check. All that. I wrote it. And I had no place in the time. Nothing, right? Literally, bro, by the end of the year, I made money off advances, bro. I I met Hot Boy, bro. I was in Florida. I was in Miami. Um, I had more major placements, bro. Like, it was crazy, bro. Everything I wrote down came true, bro. But that's because I wrote it down. I manifested it, bro. I used to dream about that shit, bro. And literally, literally, I asked God every day, bro. I prayed every day, bro. Hey, man, can I please have this? Can I please have that, bro? Can you please pour a little bit of grace on me and let me do this shit? Simple as that, bro. That's the reason I am in a position today. If you want to take my advice, go for it, bro. That's why I'm telling you. That's why I'm sending this video. If you don't want to take my advice and you say, and you, you say, and you think I sound foolish, bro, that's all you. That's all you. I'm not forcing you to that stuff, right? If you don't want to go to religious route, fuck it. Law of attraction manifest it. But I believe that God is the only reason why I am here, what I am today. Like, I literally, crazy shit, bro. I listened to Wine Be Slam all throughout high school. Wrote it down, bro. The beginning of 2020. I did that shit this year, bro. 2021, bro. I met Wine Dude B Slam and had a session with him and I played him beats and we have a song. Crazy, bro. But that's just how life is, bro. That's how this shit goes. You write this shit down, you believe in it, and you have faith, bro. Faith is the number one thing. If you want to be big, bro, you got to have faith that shit's going to work out, bro. That faith is what separates people that don't believe and the people that believe. Simple as that, bro. Take care.